day in my class looks like students come in, I greet them at the door, they look on the overhead on the TV and see what we're doing for the day. We might be doing a lab, we might be taking notes. Um, right now we're working on a really fun project about earthquake proof buildings. So it's, it really changes up all the time. I'm Mr. Cloward, I'm a health teacher and we talk about a lot of uh, things that do with teen issues. We deal with teen issues and all of the things that uh, go on outside of a classroom in the high school experience. So in my class, we're going to get into lots of different things. You'll come in, we'll get into whatever we're talking about. It's going to be a really fun class. So you're going to learn things about photography. You're going to learn things about video production. Uh, we'll learn things about graphic design as well as uh, 3D graphics and animation. So you're all constantly going to be doing something different. Uh, a normal day of my class is, uh, is working the CTE standards. It's also combining other courses, math, science, English, and video arts production. Something I would like to note my students to know about me is that I genuinely care about them, no matter who they are. They're gonna be welcome to my classroom. I try my best to make sure everybody is included, no matter who they are, where they come from, their background. I think they're all important. In class, honestly, as long as you're trying, everyone is at different abilities. I know uh, we get people in here that have never danced before, and then people in here that have danced their whole lives. So honestly, as long as you're trying your best, I'm happy. I expect that my students be ready to pay attention and work hard. I don't need you to do much more than come to school every day with a charged computer a pencil, and the materials that I've already given you. My expectations of students that come in my class is that they lean in, meaning that try it, right? Take a risk. Try stuff that you're not familiar with, and we'll help you. We'll help you. There's a group of people that's going to help you learn. So you'll never make a mistake, right? You'll learn all the way. I want students to know uh, that my class is very relaxed. Uh, we try to have fun, even though we work hard. Um, I push them to be their best math student that they can be, uh, but we do have fun in my class. Uh, I like to golf. Uh, I'm a boys golf coach here at Downey. Uh, I like to spend time with family and friends, hang out with my dog. I'm a huge Godzilla fan. If you can, you can see what my desk kind of looks like with all the different things. I'm supported in my habit by my wife and kids. They give me lots and lots of stuff. I try to make my class interesting. I like to do a lot of uh, different things, so hopefully they will enjoy it uh, when I have them next year. My hobbies, well being that I'm an English teacher, I like to read, I like to write, but I also love spending time with my son, he's two years old, and I like to crochet. I like to obviously read, I'm an English teacher. Um, I do like to play sports, I like to do yoga, I like watching sports. Um, I like to paint. I'm not good at it, but I will paint. Um, I like to do pottery. Again, not good at pottery, but I still do it. <laughs> Here we have the French rooster, which is the equivalent of uh, the, uh, the American eel. Okay. So what the students don't know is if there is a spy eye over here, so I can see everything <laughs> yeah. um, Ask questions. Don't be afraid. <laughs> I would say um, ensure your attendance, make sure you're here. If you're not here, you can't learn, and then get to know your teachers. Don't okay. be afraid to come see your counselor in the counseling office. We're here to help. And don't be afraid to make new friends. Everybody is nervous, just like you are, so it's okay to have those feelings, but definitely make new friends, because there's plenty of kids in the same boat. Yeah. <laughs> and get involved. Yes. Join clubs, join sports, that's how you make friends. My name is Brad. I'm in my fifth year as a campus supervisor here at Downey. My name is Denny. Uh, nine years, almost ten years as a campo here in Johansson. For, for me, is you know, and I don't want to scare no kids, is we're here to make sure you guys get the class, get the proper education, and make sure that you're safe. Um, we're going to stay on you about those things because to me, like, it's not a job, it's, it's, it's life. You know, I, that, yeah. is, that is a big thing. Get to know who we are. I would just piggyback on that and say, uh, don't be afraid of us. We're here to help you. Uh, we're here to make sure you're safe, that you get here every day and you get home to your parents every day safely. 
Um, yeah, we can be hard on kids sometimes when they uh, break the rules constantly, but our job is uh, safety, is student safety, and that's all of our work. Our paramount concern is to make sure that the kids are safe here every single day. We're all nice guys and, and ladies, and uh, we are very approachable, so don't be afraid to come up and ask us a question, or if you need something, um, come, come find us and we'll help you out as much as we can.